today I'm going to show you the Falcom 2 40 watt laser cutting machine. I got this machine in exchange for making this video. The machine is almost completely assembled in the box. You still have to attach the laser head and the air pump and some spacers, but that's it. The first impression I got was that it's a sturdy machine. Personally, I like the look of it. Fancy grey and black. For me, it's my first laser cutting machine. I'm used to working with very big water jet machines with industrial software. So I had to download some laser cutting software and get the hang of it. I have to say it's surprisingly simple. Very user friendly and easy. I don't want to place my computer in the shop as it is very dusty. So I had to use the sneaker network. Luckily the machine comes with a micro SD card. In the software I could generate a G-code that can instantly be read by the machine. The laser on this machine is not safe to look at directly. Although the laser is covered by a protective screen, the machine also comes with safety glasses. The laser cutter has some unique features, like the air assist pump. It's a small air pump that blows air on the sides of the laser blowing away the smoke from the laser head. As you can see the laser is cutting the wood very fast and I have to say very precise. It has 40 watts of power and it can cut 25,000 mm per minute ultra fast. It has an adjustable light beam. The beam is very handy for casing the work area. The laser head has a triple monitor system, air, fire and lens. When something is wrong with either one it will give a red light so you know what to do. I made the design for this build in a CAD program and imported the file as a DXF but you could use any vector based program. I made a complex cutout file to test the limitations of the machine. 
but the machine could handle it all. Some joints were under 0.5 mm and still holding. For me the machine could be very useful for leather work, so I decided to use some leather in my presentation project, using the unique precise feature by pushing the top button on the laser head for a number of seconds. The machine is now working on a different level of precision. I was very impressed with how clean it came out. My overall impression of the machine is that it is very versatile and minimalistic in a good way. What you see is what you get, but all is robust and works very well, at least in the short time I used it. I will most certainly use the machine more often in my work.